Hello my stinky poopy babies. Today I'm gonna make the hot cocoa peppermint from Starbucks mixed with my coffee. I brewed the coffee so I am gonna add this at the bottom of the cup and then I'm gonna mix it together with the coffee. little peppermint candy in there which I think is pretty cool if you like peppermint candy this would be a really good hot cocoa I got this at Jewel for two bucks and the salted caramel I got it for three now I'm just pouring in the brewed coffee I made It's about six to eight ounces. The instructions for the hot cocoa it says to add like a cup of hot milk, but since I'm making it into coffee, this is pretty good. I'm just gonna mix it and make it kind of frothy. Uh, if you had Mexican or Latin uh, hot chocolate, we do this a lot. And here I am just gonna use my frother to to make my milk frothy. And not too much because the cup is like 20 ounces and it's it's pretty good. I put in the hot settings to make it more frothy. The cold setting is cool, but uh, for this time I want it kind of warm, you know. I see that it's ready. It does automatically turn off, but um, I think I, I was just imp impatient. That's why I did it. So now I'm just gonna pour it. And then I um, got this from Wish. It came with a bunch of stencils and the cocoa shaker. It's pretty good. You just have to practice to get better. Like right now, you'll see that I still need a bit more practice. This is my second time with this stencil, and I know that the cup is kind of the wrong size and everything, but. I want it at all. Uh, I think for tomorrow I'll probably make it smaller, but this one came out better than the first time I did it, especially this stencil. So I'm pretty proud of this, but yeah.